we are seeing volume and price increase in XRP off the heels of some news that came in last night. I'm going to read this. SEC sources confirm Gary Gensler's resignation. In a stunning revelation, an anonymous official from the Securities and Exchange Commission, the SEC, has reported has reportedly disclosed that Gary Gensler, the chairman of the SEC, has submitted his resignation following an internal investigation. This bombshell news has sent shockwaves through the financial industry, raising concerns about the integrity of the regulatory body and the implications for investors' confidence. The anonymous SEC official who spoke on the condition of the anonymity due to the sensitivity nature of the matter stated that Gary Gensler has resigned from his position as chairman of the SEC following an internal investigation into alleged misconduct. The details of the investigation are confidential, but the decision to step down underscores the seriousness of the findings. What we're seeing a reflection in XRP price as we speak. The market is responding to this news. We know that this has been an ongoing lawsuit. Gary Gensler has been the head of it. Uh, just We feel it's just been an attack against Ripple, an attack against XRP, labeling it in a, in a security. And uh, we know as well that XRP is not a security. Just gonna read some more news that I found today. Uh, just just some more positive news on XRP. And like I said, we're, we're seeing the price increase. We're seeing volume come in right now. Could this be the end? I don't know. I'm just constantly reminded of a dream that the Lord gave me um, regarding uh, seeing a moon, seeing uh, a calendar, and then seeing an American flag. Could something be going on in this 4th of July season with crypto? Uh, you know, we, we soon shall find out. Here's an article from, from you today, and it simply states this. XRP-based hedge fund filed with SEC raises new expectations. XRP-based hedge fund filed with SEC raises new expectations. Patrick L. Riley, a CEO of Reaper Financial, has hinted at an exciting development for XRP. He stated on Twitter that Arrington Capital, a digital asset management firm in blockchain-based capital markets founded in 2017, has recently filed with the SEC for an XRP hedged fund. Riley adds a piece of good news that there is expectation for all to go well. Many of us are believing that right now. Arlington received uh, recently filed with the SEC for an XRP-based hedge fund. Seems there is an expectation for all to go well, the Reaper CEO tweeted. Arrington's website mentions uh, Arrington XRP Capital, which is a multi-strategy hedge fund investigation, is in the early stage venture and public markets. Hedge fund pools investors money and, and investment. Uh, let me say that again. Hedge funds pool investors money an investment, it is in the hopes of making a positive return. Typical investors include institutional investors such as pension funds and insurance companies and just rich individuals. According to the SEC Investor Guide, hedge funds are exempt from some of the reg uh, regulations extended to protect investors. Some hedge fund managers may not be required to register or file public reports with the SEC, depending on the number of assets in hedge funds advised by the manager. So anyhow, this is just some some more positive news that we're looking at with in regards to XRP. Um, I'm excited, I'm, I'm praying and believing that we're going to see XRP skyrocket very soon. Let's just pray right now. In the name of Jesus, Lord God, we love you and we bless you, we, we magnify you, Father. Father, I ask for a special blessing upon everybody on here today, Lord God, that you bless our ministries, Lord, bless this wealth transfer, bless our finances in the name of Jesus Christ. Lord, I ask, Father, that you will pour out your spirit upon everybody on here today, Father. 
Father, I ask for your wisdom and knowledge and understanding, your direction, Father, for our lives today. Lord, I ask, Father, that you will reveal to us, give us plans and, and insight into the plans of heaven, Lord God, for our lives to, to, in the position that we're supposed to take, Father. I pray, Father, for everybody on here right now that is dealing with sickness or loss, that you bring healing to their bodies, healing to their families, Father. I pray for those that are feeling hopeless today, that you will bless them with hope, Father, that you will lift up our heads today, Lord God. The joy of the Lord is our strength, Lord God. I pray you renew our minds, Father. Open up our eyes to see what you want us to see today. Open up our ears to hear what you want us to hear today, Father. I pray for revival in our churches and our communities. I pray for revival in our nation today, Lord. I pray you bring healing to this nation, Father. We know that there's a shaking going on right now, Lord, but we pray, Lord, that you will protect us, send your angels around us, Lord God. Your word says that your angels encamp around them that fear the Lord, Father. Send your angels around us today, Lord. Hallelujah. I ask that you open the windows of heaven upon our families today. Lord, that you pour out blessings so great we cannot even contain them, that they just overflow to all those that are around us, Lord. Bless us to be a blessing. Order our steps. Set our feet on paths of righteousness today. Lord, help us to, to, to walk in holiness, Father, to be separate from sin, Lord God, in the systems of this world and dedicated unto you and your will. Father, we pray, Lord God, let your kingdom come. Let your will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Father, that you will give us this day our daily bread. Lord, forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us and our families not into temptation. Lord, I ask that you deliver us from all evil today. Deliver us from the plots and the plans of the enemy today, Father. Oh, God, cover his traps and his snares for our lives, Father. Help us to be privy, privy, Lord God, to his devices, to not be ignorant to the devices of the enemy, Father, but to walk in victory, to walk in power, to walk in anointing today, Father, to walk in your will today, Lord God. We take authority today in the name of Jesus Christ. We take authority over the enemy today in Jesus' mighty name. Oh, hallelujah, Jesus. I speak victory over every believer on here right now. I speak life. I speak healing. I speak strength right now, Father. I pray the fire of the Holy Ghost consumes us today, Lord God. Oh, hallelujah, Lord God. Set us on fire. Put your desires in our heart today. Father, fill our heart with your desires, Father. In the name of Jesus, Lord, we will trust in you today. We will walk by faith today and not by sight in Jesus' mighty name. And we will go from victory to victory today. Victory is ours today in Jesus' name. God bless you all. Have a great, today, great day today in Jesus' name.